Hello everybody, welcome back to Wolf Here, because today, the title might be a little bit shocking. But yes, we're going to be talking about edibility for the MCC teams, both the mascots and, well, I, I, I'm not going to go over every single MCC team, but I, I picked my, my pick for most edible MCC team based on the players. It'll make more sense once we get to, to it. You might be wondering, Wolfie, why are you talking about this? Well, I wanted to make a video today, and I was thinking of ideas, and I was like, you could probably eat a rabbit, because people do that. And I was like, maybe I can just talk about every single one. So let's do that today. Um, <laughs> today, I, I have my research open, okay? I did a whopping 10 Google questions, one for every uh, MCC thing. Here's a tier list. We're gonna be filling out this tier list, okay? Um, going uh, one by one on how edible every single um, MCC team mascot is. Um, the way this ranking works is, first, the, the middle three categories, yes, maybe, and no, are gonna be based off of the animal it is based on. And then the second factor will be the color it is, and if that color is often associated with food. Um, and you can get a bonus point or a minus one point. Um, there is no neutrals. There could be, uh, there might be neutrals, we'll see. Um, uh, you can probably guess which colors will fall under uh, no <laughs> and yes. Either way, let's begin. Starting off with the red rabbits. Now I looked up, can you eat rabbits? And yes, you can eat rabbits. So um, that automatically puts it in yes. And is the color red associated with food? Yes, tomatoes. So there you go. And meat happens to be red sometimes too. So ra red rabbits, yes plus in terms of edibility. Very good team icon and team to eat. Uh, don't get on the red rabbits because I will eat you. Um, <laughs> Next up, uh, orange ocelots. I looked up, can you eat ocelot? There isn't even an answer for that. So I looked up, can you eat cat? And it's not advised. Um, and ocelots are like more rare cats. So no, we'll, we'll put that one in no. Um, let's just not do that, okay? Let's just not eat ocelots. Then the color orange, is, color, is the color orange associated with food? Yes, pumpkin. So there you go. Now it's in maybe. Uh, next up, yak. I actually did not know this. But yak is apparently a healthy lean protein that is lower in cholesterol and saturated fats than beef. So it is very good for you. So that puts it in yes. Um, and then let's look at the color. Yellow. Is the color yellow associated with food? Sometimes. Um, but, uh, uh, you know, for the most part, if there's something yellow on your, on your plate, you'll be like, yeah, that looks about right. So yes plus for yellow yaks. Next up, lime llamas. I also did not know this. This is an ed educational channel at this point. Um, can you eat llama? Apparently in Argentina, they eat llamas. So yes, you very much could eat llama. And is the color lime green uh, associated with food? Um, yes, in plants. But I, if your food was, if your meat was light green, unless it's covered in like pesto or a different sauce, I would be slightly concerned. But for the sake of this video, it's just about whether the color is edible and lime green is in fact edible. So yes plus. Actually, you know what? I've decided, no, it's just gonna stay in there. Um, <laughs> <clears throat> anyways, next up, um, geckos. Can you eat gecko? Uh, apparently, they are generally safe to eat when cooked properly. Uh, I don't know where they eat uh, geckos. I did not, uh, it's apparently uh, lizards are a popular de delicacy in many parts of the world. And um, when you look at gecko specifically, yes, gecko is also um, said to be edible in a survival situation, which makes me slightly concerned. So we'll put it in maybe. But then is the color green, dark green, associated with um, with with food? Well, yes, but it's the same thing as llama, where if your meat was green, I would be slightly concerned, unless it's covered in pesto, then it would be okay. Next up, axolotl. Um, no, coyote, sorry. <laughs> Next up, coyote. Um, can you eat coyote meat? Yes, um, it is. Uh, it says, while this meat may not be as common today, it is still consumed by some hunters and adventurous eaters. Um, I would not advise you to, uh, to eat it because it, I would be sad because it's a dog, but um, you, you can, so it's in maybe. But then is the color cyan associated with food? No, definitely not. As far as I can remember, I have not eaten anything that's cyan, at least not naturally. So that goes in no. Um, <laughs> next up, axolotl. Um, apparently... Uh, axolotls are, uh, were a source of protein for ancient Mexicans, and they're still consumed in many areas on the su su supposition uh, that they will protect against respiratory and other diseases. Whatever that means. Sounds like a big maybe to me. 
Um, but then is the color light blue or aqua associated with um, uh, food? No. So it's going in no. Next up, bat. Um, bats are regularly hunted and consumed in Oceania. So that, I mean, they can eat it. But I think most of us do know um, that a, a bat did cause a certain something very important in the world. So if, just for that reason, I'll put it in no. Um, I'm just putting it in no. That um, It's just going to be a no uh, for me. And then can you eat blue? I wouldn't eat blue. So no minus. Um, let me not look at this page. I don't want to see that. Um, can you eat panda is the next question. Um, first of all, I would not say so. It's going to go in no either way, regardless of the answer. But let's read it. Um, so, uh, hunting and killing giant pandas is illegal. Do not eat pandas in China. Well, I don't, I'm not in China, but I also don't have any pandas around. So, it's just going to stay in no. Um, also, is the color purple edible? Uh, you sometimes, maybe a little bit. Um, I noticed that this, like, uh, color factor is very beneficial for the first half of teams. The second half is very heavily struggling. Purple is, works in fruit. Um but not in meat. If your meat was purple, it is not, that's not good. <laughs> that's either very raw or something else went wrong with it. So let's just, let's just put it in no minus also because I don't want to eat a panda. I love pandas, so no. Um, can you eat a parrot? You can eat any parrot species such as macaws, lorries, and other parrots if you were hungry enough. Thanks, Google. Appreciate that. Um, let's just put it in like a maybe. Can you eat pink? Nah. So, I mean, you could if it's if it's a fruit, but not if, I mean, your meat could be pink. But I feel like a bird a bird is usually white meat, so let's put it in now. Um, okay, that's that question. So, which is the most edible uh, team icon? It's either red or yellow. So, if you're on red or yellow, watch out, okay? <laughs> Next up, uh, players. Now, some people you may associate with food already because of their name, like fruit berries or velvet is cake. His name literally says that he is cake. You can eat him, okay? He's edible. However, um, when looking at teams, we're looking at overall edibility uh, across the team. Um, so all four members of the team have to participate. And there was one team I could think of, and upon doing a little bit of research, that makes the most sense for this, even though every individual member isn't necessarily associated with food, but in, in combination they are, mostly because of a duo. Um, which is the uh, red team, Red Rabbits, from uh, MCC Pride 23. Um, congratulations, you are the most edible team, according to Wolfie Extras, um, because Pizza Hut and Green is the pizza crust duo, and pizza crust happens to be bread, and you for sure can eat bread. Um, Gemini Tay, as much as this profile picture doesn't show it, um, I think is a, she ha is a reindeer in the other profile picture, and reindeer, deer, you can eat those. You can eat deer. I don't know about reindeer. I have not done the research far enough, but you can eat deer. So that's that counts for edibility. And then zombie Cleo is a zombie. And if you've ever played Minecraft, if you're in a pinch, if you're in a pickle or really struggling, uh, you can eat rotten flesh, which you get from zombies. So this is now the most edible Minecraft event team out there, okay? It's number one. Feel free to argue in the comments below if you, for whatever reason, care to do so. Um, but the red team from MCC Pride 23, most edible. Honorable mention, um, the green team from uh, MCC 24. Um, Jim is on here for the same reason. Five Up, he is a vegetable. I've spoken to Five Up about what he actually is, and I call him a turnip. And other people say he's like a, an onion or whatever. Um, he He's a vegetable, okay? It doesn't really matter what type of vegetable, but you can eat him, okay? He's, he's a vegetable. And then Harvey... Is called tapple. If you take out the T, you get apple. He's an apple, so you can eat that. Um, Ollie, Ollie's a little bit more concerning. You know, he's a British man. Um, that's about it. Uh, so I would not advise eating him. <laughs> I don't think he's a portrayed himself as like an, an animal. I mean, he was on rats SMP. If you want to eat a rat, I would not suggest it. So, but that's like a little bit of a bit of a stretch because there's multiple people who would fall under that, and then I would have to redo redo my research, and I uh, can't be asked. So, let's just consider this second place because they have three edible people on. Well, three edible online uh, reflections of themselves uh, in here before anyone tries to you know 
cancel me, whatever. Uh, I also just remembered that Joel is smallish beans. I, I did not look at Joel team. So potentially there is another team out there because this, this Aqua team, as much as a Cub fan and, and Scar d don't look edible, you got fruit berries and smallish beans and berries and beans are pretty good for you. So, hey, maybe they're, they're like runner up for like third. Let me know which team you think is most edible, um, both the team icons and the player combination. And um, yeah, let, let's have a great discussion about this topic. Thank you for watching. I'll see you later. Goodbye.